Y'all watching Knicks Fan TV. Let's go to let's go to the uh, the play rate. Let's go to the play rate tonight. Um, so let's start it off with the starting five. Noah Vonley, seven points on the night, four dimes, five rebounds. You know, minus six for the night, one for one. He hit his one three pointer. Well, what's your rating? Give me a rating in the chat. Noah Vonley from one to ten. What's Noah Vonley's numbers? Oh man, see, I don't know if the the points are indicative of the, of the impact. Because yeah. there's like a team defense thing that happened in that first quarter, and Mo and Noah kind of had like a a lot to do with it, mm-hmm. and even hitting some key threes and being up being up some guys. So I would have to say I'm a, I'm gonna give him a seven. Yeah, yeah, I give him a six. I, I thought he played well out there. Um, I, I I thought he definitely impacted the game, as you said. Um, his first his first night as a starter, and he filled this. He filled the stat sheet up: two steals, one block to go. He pinned Steph shit against the backboard. I'm gonna give him a six. I, I give Vonley a, a cool six. It's funny, cause I I feel, I feel like he could have got higher if he got more in the game. I mean, I don't. I, don't, I feel like maybe Coach Fizz could have played him a little bit more. Actually, I don't know how many minutes he played. Mm-hmm. But I felt like he could have played more. He played 22 like, minutes tonight. 22 minutes. Yeah, I felt like he could have played more, man. Cause I felt like he was really effective. When yeah, he was out. yeah. It was, it was he was he was off on that second unit. It was on there crazy in the third. Um, Money Mitch, 29 minutes tonight, three for five shooting, seven points, six boards, um, two steals for Money Mitch. Yeah, give me a rating for Money Mitch tonight. What what you think? Ah, uh, I want to say seven two. But I'm not, I, I don't. He didn't do quite as good as Vonley to me, but he kind of just filled a need that he just he just felt that he just filled that need. He, he was like the safety man. He just kept kept things from getting out of control on defensive end. Yeah, I, so, I thought. Yeah, I, I think. He, I think you see. You going seven? Six point nine. Like it's yeah. it's putting hairs at this point because I still feel like Vonley did a little bit better. Yeah, but. But I still like Mitch. Just kind of held it down for us. I give Vonley a seven. I had I gave him a six. I give him a seven. I give Mitch a six. I give Mitch a six. I, 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 but I, I like what Mitch gave us out there in those minutes, and and he got some nice experience. Um, you know, everybody was basically minus on the night, so it's hard to kind of go by plus minus. I'm just going more so what I saw, especially in that first half, and what I was encouraged yeah. by. Um, yeah, no, those steals were active, man. He was. Yeah. Was, yeah. All right, let's go to Frank. 26 minutes, 6 of 11 from the field, 3 for 7. He shot the ball, man. He, he shot the ball. Yeah, man. Um, 17 points, 2 dimes, 1 steal, minus 12 on the night, uh, 3 turnovers. What what'd you, what'd you think about Frank tonight? Give me Frank's rating, 1 to 10 in the chat. 1 to 10? Oh, man. He, shoot. I'm going to give him – I'm not going to – I'm going to give him a little – I'm thinking seven and a half, eight, maybe, man. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna give him an eight, man, because he stepped up to the challenge. Yeah. World champions on prime time, first yeah, night full, as a starter. I'll give him the full eight. I'll yeah. Full, I'll give him the full eight. Yeah. Listen, he was minus twelve, but you know what? I, I like the, I like the confidence that he had tonight. You know what I mean? He's going, he's going up against one of the best in the world, the best team in the in the world, and and uh, and he didn't shy away from it. You, you know what I'm saying? And I think that's a good carryover into the next game. Yeah, he needs more assists. He needs more assists. But listen, it'll is, come. I'm I'm not even going to give him – because he had, like, mad hockey assists. Because yeah. it's, it's one of those things where he didn't get the direct assist, but the offense was kind of – was flowing. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Uh, like, go ahead. Like, he just he just made the right pass off the curl play and that, and then the passer or the curl play passed to somebody else and – so I still feel like he did his, he did his thing right Yeah, I, I thought he did his minutes. 26 minutes, Jails. 17 points in 26 minutes. Yeah. You know, I mean, I can't be mad at that. Um, let's go to Dot. 30 minutes, 5 of 12 shooting, 2 for 6 from three-point lane. Seven boards. He's been a good rebound to Jay Ellis. That's my God. 12 Three. points. Minus 8 on the night. What's your rating on, Jay, uh, on uh, Damian Dot in the night? I'm going to give that guy a seven as well, man. I'm giving sevens for my starters. Sevens, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I, I got to agree. Um, Like like I said, man, this this kid has earned it. Keep him in the starting rotation. I just like the dynamic that he brings to this team, man. He can facilitate. He moves well. He shoots the ball well. He plays with confidence. And he plays hard on both ends, man. I, I yeah, like that, man. When Knox comes back, though, it's going to get this. It's going to get crazy. <laughs> yeah, well, see, the decision is going to be... 
where do you, what do you do with Knox? Do you put Knox at the four? Do you bring him off the bench? Do you bring Dotson off the bench? You right. Know? Then there's a thing with Mario too. That's he's gonna get a little crazy. Things, yeah. Things, things are gonna go Trayer, back. He's gonna get a little crazy. Facts. He's gonna get. <laughs> yeah. Let's go to let's go to Timmy. Thirty five minutes, nine to twenty one from the field. 24 points, four dimes, two rebounds for Timmy, minus 15 on the night. Uh, how you how you rating Timmy tonight? Um, I think I'm going to give Timmy the eight. I'm going to give Timmy the eight, too, man. You going to give him the eight? I'm going to give him the eight, too. He, I felt like he wanted it today, man. He, he did. I thought so. I I, I I thought so. What do you guys think in the chat of, of Timmy's performance tonight? Uh, Carlito, what do you think? It's I hope Carlito's on the line because we're gonna get back to the phone. Oh, look in a at minute. that! Carlito gave the eight point. Carlito gives him an eight point three. Okay, <laughs> okay. So Carlito had, was was impressed with Timmy tonight. Yeah, I mean, like you said, JLs, he he wanted it tonight. My man was shooting from half court. He was so jittery. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, well, what you know, like you said, we need Timmy's offense out there some nights. And listen, you're just gonna have to live with the erraticness. I don't think it's ever gonna gonna get uh that much better so you just you just gotta take it as it comes man what's kind of crazy is that he's getting more accurate with the erratic with the erratic yeah stuff, facts is, is insane so facts. I, who, what do we end up with this guy who can make all these crazy erratic shots for us because he's just getting the reps in yeah we call him john stocks exactly <laughs> you know what i mean we, we call that, him jr smith very, that might happen halfway during the season yeah he's so Taking these erratic facts, and I'm not calling him that by heart. I'm not comparing the heart. There's only one John Starks <laughs> back here. Shout out to John, but um, you know, listen, it, it is what it is. We just gotta live with it. Super Mario, 18 minutes, uh, three boards, six points tonight, three and nine shooting. What do you give him, Super Mario? Uh, yeah, yeah, five. Yeah, I give him a five. I'll give him a five. <laughs> Uh, Lance, are we gonna rate Lance? Uh, give him a three. <laughs> 19 minutes, one board, one assist, two points. I'm uh, matter of fact, I'm giving Lance a two. Jeez, I'll give Lance a two. Oh, gosh, I ineffective on both ends, man. I give him a 2.8. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm giving I'm giving Lance a 2.8. Um, Canner, 20 minutes, he still had his typical boards on the night 13 boards, eight points, three turnovers, two dimes. What do you, what do you give him, Canner, tonight? Oof, the defense is bad. The rebounds are amazing. Yeah. The, the he, he he was kind of quarterbacking a little bit out there today. Mm, I might give him I'm a five. A, I'm gonna no, say a six. You going six for Cannon? Yeah, I'm gonna yeah. give him. A, I'm gonna give him a five. I, I don't know, man. I wasn't really uh, too impressed with his play tonight. Yeah, he was on the boards. He was on the boards. Um, so so give him credit for that. All right. Um, Trey Burke, twenty two points. Uh, sorry, 22 minutes, 5 of 12 from the field, 3 for 7 downtown, 15 points, 2 assists, 2 rebounds. What are you guys rating Trey Burke's performance tonight? 1 to 10. JLs. Uh, 1 to 10. I'm going to give Trey... I'm going to give him a 6 and a half. Yeah, I'm going to give him a 6 as well. I think, you know... Um, like I said, I thought he was in there for a little bit too long, but I did think when he did get those 15 points, we were up by 10 points in the third quarter. Let's not forget yeah. that. And a big reason of that was Trey Burke. Yeah. So um, you got to give him credit for that. He was just in there for a little bit too long, and he wasn't passing the ball. So I'll give yeah. him a knock, and I'll give him a six. I'll give him a six. And I think we're in range. I think the chat I think the chat kind of agrees. Um, a lot of sixes, a lot of sixes for Burke. Keith Sinclair gives him a 4.5. Alex a five. The shooter Jeez. four. <laughs> yeah, a lot of he's in, he's within range. Um, ISO, what do you give him? ISO tonight, sixteen minutes, two Jeez. points. I didn't even see him. Yeah, I give ISO a one. Then he wasn't he wasn't he wasn't doing nothing out there tonight. Yeah, yeah. He wasn't yeah. doing. Nothing. I mean, like I said, him and Trey pretty much cancel each other out. So yeah, you know, on together. At yeah, the same time. yeah. ISO didn't have like, him going, man. That bench suffers with the with the. That's the that's the thing we was kind of worried about too with the with the um the lineups. With the lineups, yeah. Like there's no offensive defensive balance. Right. right. We have all the defense in, in the starting lineup. I mean, you have Lance in the, in the second unit, but then after that, it's just like yeah. free for all for ball movement and defense. Yeah, and I mean, like I said, when you have Trey out there and ISO out there, they're the same player. So if Trey's out there dribbling around, nobody else is getting the rock, including ISO. So, yeah. you know. It is what it is. He, he didn't have his best game tonight, but whatever. All right, let's go back to the phone. There's two people I don't want to see on this floor ever again. Trey Burke and Lance Thomas. They, 
Listen, listen, bro. Listen. <laughs> so, I know y'all okay. fans like Trey Burke. I know y'all like him, but what he does to this Knicks team, we can't have that because we don't have players that can go get their own. You, you understand? Yeah. 